This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. I thought I didn't measure up as Pathfinder. Director Addison keeps her own counsel. I keep mine. And when you disagree? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the Golden Worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eos. How? You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable, so how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Just point me to my ship and I'll be out of here. They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. <sighs> Something wrong? Ryder, please see me and Sam Nood on the Hyperion. Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No. I'm fine. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. You know what they say. It's not paranoia. If someone is out to get you, yeah. Time this week. It's getting worse. First one was small stuff. This one could have hurt bad if I'd been closer. That's not good. Hmm. Sorry. Understate. Mission? Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Did you talk to security about this? I've scanned all the. Sounds like a lot went. Yeah, I guess. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me. If... Sure thing. I've sent the location. Find out why. Be careful. Please be advised that Hyperion docking procedures are now complete. No stand up.
phone. I'm gonna need to make things easy to find. Finally. Go, let's go, I'm bored, let's go. At least now in between cutscenes you can move about normally. Unless it's really quick, which is also great. Why is it telling me to go back that way? That's not good. Hello Sarah, welcome back to Samnode. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before should reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential? You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. I don't understand the need for secrecy. Your father felt it was for the best. What was he trying to hide? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. And that's... me, now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique, tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. I don't follow. You're an AI. So, what's different? I am a new form of AI, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. That's... pretty amazing. But beyond what many people will accept, your father knew some would fear it. Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. 
We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. They call her the Tempest. Let's go take a closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. Yeah. Let's go see the rest of Helios. Hold it, hold it! You're not going anywhere. Damn it. Is something wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest's supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with the family, didn't you? <laughs> Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential. But I miss him. I know. I got Pretty family too, Ben. Me and the new Garrus look alike. It's done. This one's gonna kill me. <laughs> Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. Lo adding. Lo adding. Oh, maybe we'll finally get to uh, some actual gameplay now. Boop, 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 boop. If you see a loading time, I always get the jeopardy. And it's weird because I'm in the UK and we don't even get Jeopardy. So where's that reference come from? Everything state of the art. Labs, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, of course. The best in their field. Is it Good to see you're looking so well, Sarah. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. So if you're just tuning in, we've chosen the female character for the first That's few... That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all-around wrench jockey. 